Hey everybody, in this video we're going to take a look, a really close look at the crumple brush. So we go into our brushes palette and then crumple is a really really nifty brush. Um, on a sphere of um, a sphere like this crumple will look really really nice you'll get a nice effect a very aged look or crumpled look uh, this would be good for bags or clothing yeah, if this was somebody's leg and they're, you're trying to model jeans or something that that's a good way to show ripples in the uh, jeans uh, or I don't know or even somebody's hair maybe so let's see uh, maybe I don't know Let, uh, let's increase the intensity so you Z intensity to 100 nice okay that's pretty extreme probably too much now at that intensity um, you're going to want to move very slowly with crumple um, because if you move slowly the effects are died down a whole bunch and you can get a really nice effect like isn't that cool that that could be water or something really really fancy I love this brush I should use this more often what would that be okay so spacebar brushes palette okay C because it's crumple C uh, where is it oh yeah see you see you okay I see you see you okay crumple 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 <laughs> fancy fancy now let's go on the other side um, wait hold on okay other side now if you move very very slowly the effects are very very faint but I don't know you, you can just play with it and get a nice feel for what uh, this brush is all about it is really really handy cool that is the crumple brush